Okay, here we go. What's up guys and welcome back to the John Q channel. Thanks so much for watching. Today's video, I'm reviewing Sandmark's DJI Mavic Pro filters. These guys right here. Got my drone with me, got the DJI Mavic Pro, and I have the Sandmark filter right here. It's the Sandmark ND8 slash PL filter. It's simple as this. You just take your ND filter and you just pop it on like that. It's, it's that simple. Really, really. All right, let's fly. Why do I live in the Midwest? Okay, uh, small disclaimer, Sandmark did send me these filters to review on my DJI Mavic Pro. I am an avid user of, of my drone in both photography and videography. They did send me this stuff to review. I'm gonna give you my honest thoughts. If it sucks, I'll tell you if it sucks. If it's good, I'll tell you it's good. You're, you're probably asking like, why on earth, Johnny, why on earth would I ever wanna buy filters for my drone? Well just like filters for your camera, like your DSLR, you wanna put ND filters or polarized neutral density filters on your DSLR to get better dynamic range, better contrast and colors, better exposure. I would say you most definitely need a filter for your drone. Like why would you need these filters? Well, let me tell you the features why you would need them. Uh, there's more control over your exposure. So the reduction of light in your sensor, if I were to take this filter off, like it's pretty bright, if I were to put it back on, you can see my dynamic range coming back into play, which means I have more control over my settings, which is super important to me. And you can also manage your reflections or suppress glare when you use the Sandmark filters on your drone. So I'll put that all into play, all three of those things into play into one setting, which is the filter on your drone. You can have epic drone photography and video. So that's basically why you would need filters for your drone. Just like you would need filters for your DSLR, if you don't have a filter on your camera or your drone, going to be bumping up shutter speed, probably ISO, and maybe your aperture. So when you add these filters to your drone, you add these layers of, like I said, more control and exposure, reduced lighting coming into the sensor, and you get to manage reflections and suppress glare, which is, you would think, oh, I don't need those things, but once you start going out in the field and using, your camera or your drone and you don't have a filter on, you start seeing the difference. When you start using your drone or your camera out in the field and then you realize, I wish I had a filter so I can dampen light. It kind of makes a world of a difference. And that's it guys, it's, it's that easy, it's that simple. When you use Sandmark gear, Sandmark Pro filters for your DJI Mavic Pro drone, it's perfect. I'm pretty sure they have different filters for different drones. I will put in that link to different drones if they have them in the description below, so check that out. Uh, let them know that Johnny Q sent you. And with that being said, guys, that is it for today's video. I'm freezing my butt off. It is so cold. I'm gonna go back home, warm up some hot chocolate, sit by the fire, and watch Netflix. So, <laughs> thanks so much for watching. Let me know in the comments below what you think, if you're gonna use them, and what you think of the video. All right, guys, I'll catch you guys next time on the John Q channel. Peace.